Welcome to another video. In this video, we are going to focus on dividing fractions. So these are the subtopics that we are going to discuss in this video. Number one, we are going to divide fraction by another fraction. The same time, we are going to divide whole number by fraction. And lastly, divide mixed number by a mixed number. So let's start and let's divide some fraction. Division of fraction by another fraction. So what is the general rule in dividing fraction? So in order for us to divide fraction, we must multiply numerator to the denominator and denominator to the numerator, or we simply cross multiply. For example, 2 3rd divided by 3 over 4. So we have here 2 times 4 over 3 times 3. So we simply cross multiply 2 times 4, 3 times 3. So the final answer is 2 times 4 is 8. Then 3 times 3 is 9. So the final answer is 8 over 9. What about number 2? 12 over 17 divided by 5 over 17. So let's cross multiply. 12 times 17 over 17 times 5. So we cancel 17 or the numerator or denominator. But you can do it as well in the numerator. So we're going to have 12 over 5 equals 12 divided by 5. That is 2. The remainder is 2 over 5. What about number 3? We have 6 over 15 divided by 3 over 10. So we cross multiply. So we have 6 times 10 over 15 times 3. Now, what are the numbers that we can simplify from numerator and denominator? So we can simplify 15 and 10 because 10 and 15 are divisible by 5. 10 becomes 2, 15 becomes 3. And then 6 and 3. 6 and 3 are divisible by 3. So 6 becomes 2, 3 becomes 1. So therefore, 2 times 2. And then 3 times 1. 2 times 2 is 4 over 3. That is 1 and 1 third. So this will be our final answer. So let's have another example. So this time, we are going to divide whole number and a fraction. So again, we are just simply cross multiply. For example, 5 divided by 2 third. So since 5, the denominator of 5 will be 1. And then cross multiply, 5 will remain at the numerator. So 5 multiplied by the denominator, that is 3. And then 1 times 2. 5 times 3, that's 15. 2 multiplied by 1, that is 2. And then divide our answer, 15 divided by 2 is 7. The remainder is 1 over 2. So this will be our answer. What about number 2? 6 divided by 1 fourth. So 6 multiplied by 4. Then denominator of 6 is 1. 1 times 1. 6 times 4. That is 24. Over 1. 24 divided by 1 is simply 24. So 24 is our final answer. What about number 3? 5 over 8 divided by 3. So again, let's cross multiply. Denominator of, of 3 is 1. So we're going to have 5 times 1 over 8 times 3. And then let, to simplify our answer, we're going to have 5 times 1 is 5 over 8 times 3 is 24. So the final answer is 5 over 
24. What about number 4? 3 fourth divided by 2. So we have here 3 times 1 over 4 times 2. So the final answer is 3 times 1 is 3 over 4 times 2 is 8. So the final answer is 3 over 8. So let's have the last example. So this time, we are going to divide mixed number by a mixed number. For example, 8 and 1 fourth divided by 2 and 1 over 8. Now, how do we divide mixed number by a mixed number? So we must change the mixed number into improper fraction. So first, let's have 4 times 8 is 32 plus 1. That is 33 over 4. Divide by 8 times 2, 16, plus 1, that is 17, over 8. And then let's cross multiply. So we're going to have 33 times 8 over 4 times 17. We can simplify 8 and 4 because 8 and 4 are divisible by 4. So 8 becomes 2. 4 becomes 1. So therefore, we have 33 times 2 over 1 times 17. 33 times 2, that is 66 over 1 times 17 is 17. Now, let us write our answer in simplest form. Let us divide 66 by 17. So 66 divided by 17 is... 3. The remainder is 15 over 17. So 3 and 15 over 17. That is our final answer. What about number 2? 25 and 1 third divided by 5 and 1 third. So let us change 25 and 1 third into improper fraction. 3 times 25, that is 75 plus 1, that is 76 over 3 divide by 3 times 5 is 15 plus 1 that is 16 over 3 and then cross multiply that is 76 times 3 over 3 times 16 we can cancel both denominator and you can do it as well in the numerator so let us cancel 3 so we have 76 over 16. And then, let us write our answer in simplest form. 76 divided by 16. That is 4 and 12 over 16. So this will be our final answer. Or you can write this one in simplest form. What about number 3? Go ahead and find the quotient of this fraction. Number 3, we have 3 over 8 divided by 2 and 1 fourth. So let us write 3 over 8. Divide by, let us change 2 and 1 fourth into improper fraction. 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 plus 1. That is 9 over 4. And then cross multiply. 3 times 4 over 8 times 9. What are the numbers that we can simplify from numerator and denominator? We can simplify 4 and 8 because it is divisible by 4. So 4 becomes 1, 8 becomes 2. Also, we can simplify 3 and 9. They are both divisible by 3. So 3 becomes 1, 9 becomes 3. So therefore, 1 times 1 over 2 times 3. The final answer is 1 over 2 times 3 is 6, is 1 over 6.